Welcome to Mr. Woods Teaches. I'm Fred Woods, ready to teach. Hi boys and girls, this is Mr. Woods Teaches. Hey, today we're working on large doubles. And if you recall, the last video we did was on small doubles. And it was like one and one make two, two and two make four, three and three make six, four and four make eight, and five and five make 10. Now, if you recall those doubles, large doubles are gonna come easy as well. well. Let's take a look at this. So what if we have six, six and six? Well, let's break it down, because you already know what this is. You should be able to know what this is. Just recall is what, it's five and five plus one and one. Look at that. 6 and 6 is 5 plus 5 and 1 and 1, and 5 and 5 make 10, and 1 and 1 make 2. 10 plus 2 is, so let's just write that down, 10 plus 2 equals 12. Now, if you're able to do that, you're able to do all the others, okay? So think about that. Let's look at it a different way now. So I have, we just did six and six. So let's do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and seven. Now we have seven and seven make, and we can count by twos. Think about that. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen. Hmm. What do you mean, Mr. Woods? Well, let's take a look at Let's break down even further. One, two, three, four, five. And take off the twos there. Five and five make ten. See that? Five and five make ten. And then two and two make four. And ten plus four is fourteen. I want you to work on that. Let's look at the others here. So add seven and seven. Here we go. Eight and eight make... 16. Again, you can count by twos. Let's take a look at that. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16. Right? Well, let's look at this. We have 8 and 8. Again, we break it down. 5 and 5 make 10. 3 and 3 make 6. 10 plus 6 is 16. Got the same answer. Let's look at 9 and 9. Look at this. 9 and 9 make what? Again, you can count by twos. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18. Let's look at that again. Oops. And I want to do 5 and 5. Let's see here. So 5 and 5 make 10, right? 4 and 4 make 8. 10 plus 8 is 18. And then last but not least, we have 10 and 10 make 20. We can break that off where I have 5 on each one. Let me get that done right. So 5 and 5 make 10. 5 and 5 make 10. And 10 plus 10 is 20. Whoa, but wait, 5, 10, 15, 20. You can count by fives. So there's more ways that you can get these numbers. I want you to work on that. I want you to um, create some flashcards with like six and six and seven and seven and eight and eight. And I want you to come up with your way on makes it so that you can remember on how to come up with an answer. Till next time. This is Mr. Woods Teaches. Remember, to be a math person, all you have to be is a person that does math. And math fluency replaces math anxiety.